no. Where are we now? I think we're in the 1950s. Gosh, golly. Are we ever gonna make it back to 2021? I sure hope so, Chloe. But at least we're back in color. Maybe if we finish a tutorial, then it'll move us forward in time. Or I could mess with this oh, remote no, a little no, bit no, more. No, 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 no. Let's just begin the tutorial, shall we? Let's recreate a retro 1950s style video in Filmora 10. First, let's import your footage into Filmora 10 and drag your chosen footage onto the timeline. Next, go to the Effects tab at the top and under Utility. Let's drag the crop effect onto the timeline a few tracks above the footage. Double click the crop effect and move the left and right slider values to 10. Now, let's add a LED to make the footage look like it was shot on an old camera. Double click your clip and under the color menu, go to the 3D LUT and find the warm film option, then add it to your clip. Next, we want a bit more graininess to the footage because the camera is in the 1950s shot on film, so they have to have a lot of grain and low light. To create this look, go to the effect tab and under overlay, find the old film section. Let's add three of these grain effects to our timeline above the footage, but below the crop effect. I'm gonna add subtle grain, dirty film, and random dust. Try to use as much grain as you want to give your footage that 1950s retro look and feel. And just like that, a finished project. Well, did it work? I don't know. Caleb! 